Good morning, you beautiful people. So today, group Friday, um, I'm ready. I'm pretty ready. You know, Ben used to say Saturday morning steer black group ride is his favorite ride. Now I can see the point. Really get your adrenaline going. See those guys joke around. Yeah, they're horrible. They're horrible. Sometimes both still love each other. Like what the hell? Well, we're waiting for the boys, right? Um, give you a little bit of update uh, about my bike. I'll show you. So I take off the foil legend wheels last night before sleep and now put these Reynolds strike wheels back on because I just figured you know what it's about half a kilo but so what it's, it's good for training and um, beach road is quite flat anyway um, brand new continental four season tires so they're a little bit heavier f compared to the GP4000 uh, but more durable, cheaper to run, I think. And uh, I trimmed the uh, the front derailleur a little bit because uh, when it's on the big chain ring, it rubs a little bit. So hopefully today is gonna solve the issue. That, I think it's the boys. Sounds like a plan. So when you boys joining us? <laughs> oh <laughs> man! <laughs> I don't know if I can keep up with you guys. Uh, everyone says that. Everyone yeah, smashed me. Through. Guy, yellow jersey. There you Chris go. Can definitely keep up with yeah. You guys going to Mantone today? Yeah, Mantone. Nice. Mantone. New wheels. No, not this one. Not this bike. The other bike. Oh yeah, the other bike. Yeah. Okay. What wheels you got? Um, they're not specialized ones. They're Bontragers. We should put on this bike. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I wanted to ask you, how do you go about yeah. um, putting a bell on your aero bars? You can't. You, you have to put on the drop right here, yeah. like uh, Chris one, yeah. That's so it. I've got the, um, so I've got the S Works uh, Aero. Aero flat, yeah, yeah. On the, on the other bike, but I've just I've got no space to, to put a bell, you know. So have you tried? Um, oh, Aero bar. What about stem? Put oh, it on underneath. the side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, on the side. I normally put it on the side, right down there, and just go thing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah okay. Try that. Yeah, try. <laughs> There's everyone. Poor. Yay! Yeah, where is he slept in again. Yeah. And uh, that one show up. Come That's on, pretty man. rare. There you go. Just waiting for Tim. And then we're ready to go. Frank Francis. Frank Francis. He's somehow here. <laughs> this is rare. This is so rare. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> and look at this gum, what tires! <laughs> who's, av who's advice? James. Um, no. Oh, I don't know who told me about the gum walls. Oh, no, Sean. Sean scores. Yeah, Sean was like, yeah, yeah, you gotta try the gum walls on this, uh, on this bike. Nice so contract. Yeah, it's pretty nice, hey? Yeah. Nice. It is, isn't it? It works. <laughs> <laughs> Where is Tim? He's, he needs to come back from Modi already. Just everyone's waiting. Rude. Morning! <laughs> Rolling. We got 12 people today. Pretty big group. Good day, you absolute legends. Now we're on Beach Road. We just passed Johnny on the left. I can't remember what happened there. So. This is the bit just after the little hill towards Morialic. We call this the sprint section. So guys can really break the peloton, do all sorts of stuff. So 12 riders today, four riders at the front, doing started a very early attack. I was at the very back of the bunch. When that happened, the remain eight of us look at each other. I was kind of hoping someone could do the trace work so I can just sit in let them close the gap, I'll save energy and uh, maybe attempt the final sprint but no one reacted so I was like uh, yeah I'm screwed so at this point I have no choice um, put out 300 watts heart rate 181 put my head down start tracing and uh, look back all the seven riders are behind me so I'm, I'm just like mm, will someone take a turn because I'm not gonna last so 
Um, at this point, I think. Yep, Paolo yelled out, shed a load, shed a load, so he and his mate won for it. We put out 600 words just right past those guys and uh, dropped down to around 200 words. It's quite a bit of relief, really. You just have to remember the guys at the front ride for their lives to try to get away with us and they rotate. If we don't work together, we have zero chance to trace them. So, 15 seconds, Paolo's done with it. His mate is pulling pretty hard, so I have to put out 600 watts to close the gap so I can sit on his wheel. And at this point on, you know, it's been, uh, you know, two minutes. So I'm hurting pretty bad. And uh, he looked back, I'm right on his tail. He started sprinting and uh, flipped, flipped his elbow. 20 seconds, he's done. Thanks, brother. I immediately put out high 300 watts. I'm thinking in my head, if I really just go for it, I think I can close the gap, but if these guys search again, I'm not gonna last. Heart rate 185. So at the front, you got Evan started the, the breakaway, and then Steve, Francis, and Tim. Tim, the legend, look back and go, yeah, I had enough. Um, yep, yeah, boy, you good luck. So at this point, the guys at the front started sprinting. I don't think Francis could hold their wheel, so stop pedaling, and I just. It's so close to the finish line, so I have to just give absolutely everything I have. Seven, eight, nine hundred watts, but does not matter because it's too late. It's just way too late. So, you know, the finish line is at the traffic light. This is actually a perfect example of a very successful early breakaway. So, you know, you just have to know whose wheels you have to hold on to and you can't let certain riders get away because they're just too strong um, yeah guys just let me know um, what I've done wrong I really enjoy doing this I wanted to make it um, a weekly routine so yeah um, congratulations to Evan and Steve uh, grab the win and uh, I'll see you next week well done but we're working hard to get this guy up. Yeah. We Today, uh, today's a perfect example that um, if you don't pay attention, they attack and it's, you know, trace it down, it's just waste so much energy. <laughs> David and I, mate. I was at the back. <laughs> David and I, you guy. Yeah. I was glad we, uh, came with me, though. I had nothing to do with it. We were, <laughs> this guy's flicking the elbow and you're behind him going, I'm not going in the front, I'm not going in the front. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> I was like, Marty, come on, take a turn. Nope. <laughs> I saw Francis was like, I'm pretty happy with third. I'm like, no. Take it out, yeah. Sneaky kilometers outside of still. Nah, nah, nah. Who in the wagon? Yeah, they're good. Keep going, that's right. That's right. That's right. So good. So good. So now we're back to uh, Fuscray. Uh, Evan, James, Paolo, and me. We're gonna do a little bit of loop down Williamstown and we just caught a big group. So here with James. Rock up in style. I like your outfit, mate. Thank you. Very, very slick. So I, um, you just ordered a bomb. Yep. How many no. months ago? Uh, seven months ago. Seven months ago. Still waiting for another 10 weeks to stay. Uh, a minimum. Minimum. But I will contact them next week yep. and get an update. It's gonna match your outfit today, I reckon. Yeah, yeah. Black and deep blue. Black and deep, yeah. Awesome titanium frame. Can't wait. Give you an update later. Not bad. It's a bit fruity. Where is it made? Pretty good. All right, just me by myself. Time to go home. Oh, I'm home now, but find something gross. You ready? Oh, 
120 k's, average speed 32. I'm pretty happy. I reckon it's pretty good for a beginner. Keep pushing, keep fighting, and we will get there. So me and Chris were just talking about it. Uh, yeah. He's waiting for a couple minutes. I think that's them. Ben, you should just come. I know you're fishing, but it's Shimano anyway. Off the beach road. That's it. Just ride and fish at the same time. Yeah. 